Hello everyone, in today's video we're going to be looking at the screen protector for the iPhone 16 Pro Max. What I have here is the one by the Elon. Uh, this is a three pack and what I'm going to do today is of course unbox to show you everything that comes inside the box. Then we're going to be installing this onto my iPhone 16 Pro Max. Let's go over the features of this case. It does have the real glass 9 H hardness, adhesive la layer for the perfect fit. Also it does have oleophobic coating. And it also does have the anti shatter film. So let's open it and see what comes inside. And now let's check everything out. So we have a little bit of installation paperwork. I'll put that on the side. And then we do have the wet wipes, dry wipes. We have three sets of those since we had three screen protectors. And then we also have the dust absorber stickers. I believe three of those as well. And of course, we do have three screen protectors. And we also do get this little frame. So the first step is to prepare your iPhone. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the wet wipe out of this little package. Um, so after we do that, all you have to do is just clean your iPhone 16 Pro Max. Make sure you take your time also end up doing all the corners as well. And also make sure you hold your phone on the sides, never on the screen during this process. Put this on the side. Then we're gonna take the dry wipe. And uh, of course we're gonna dry the screen. All right, now that you finish that, all you have to do is just take one of these dust absorbers, peel it off. Then you're just gonna pretty much put it on the screen and peel on and peel off. Try to do every single inch of this phone. All right, now that you finish that, you're gonna take the frame. So here you're gonna check where it says, let's see. It's gonna say, so here it does say the top. So the top is gonna go, of course, where the front facing camera is. So you're gonna put that on top here. And uh, there we go. All right, now that we have our screen protector, make sure you always hold it on the sides. Now we're gonna peel this first step. And then since it's peeling this way, we're gonna turn it around. And then we're gonna peel it again all the way. Now, some people do it halfway. But I just go with all the way and then of course you're gonna put it in the frame make sure it fits then you're just gonna press it down and then what I usually do is just end up doing it from the and now just let it go for now and yes I know there's some bubbles here so let it go for a little bit and now you're gonna just kind of like swipe it with the finger a little bit all the way to the edges, put a little bit of pressure. Now, I do see a little bit of bubbles, but don't worry about that. So what we're gonna do here is, uh, you can end up using your fingers, or if you have one of these squidgy things, which are pretty much designed for stuff like this. So what we're gonna do is just apply a little bit of pressure and then slowly push it towards the edge. There we go. And make sure you end up doing all the corners as well. Now, if you still have the bubbles, and like, for example, here, I do have a couple of them. So what you're going to do is you're going to put your finger inside and just going to lift it up until it has the bubble. So be careful with this. But unfortunately, this does happen. Sometimes you're going to have a little bit of bubbles. So you're going to do this until it has both of those little bubbles. Now that it hit in, you're going to let it go. And then just end up using this little tool again. Because right now it's pretty much... All right, so now we have this side complete and no bubbles. There's only one more bubble right here. So what we're gonna do here, end up doing the same thing. We're gonna put our fingernail there and then you're just gonna let it go. And then apply a little bit of pressure. 
This was a really, really easy process. And let's just clean the screen one more time so I can show you the end result. But right now, as I mentioned, there's not even one bubble, which is perfect. I don't like when, when I have bubbles, even if it's a small, tiny one. It just really annoys me. So I got to get rid of all of those. And here we go, the final result. Let me just turn off the screen so you guys can see it. Final result looks gorgeous. I mean, this is just perfect. So if you need a good quality screen protector that comes with a three pack and it's easy to install, I would definitely recommend this. Thank you guys for watching.